Hey guys, I'm Melissa and welcome back to Hopeful Happenings. I recently did a video about how to organize your story ideas and I had a few questions about how I put chapters into Word. So this is a quick video all about how to do that. two main reasons why I use chapters in Word. One, I like to have my novel separated into different sections for each chapter. This really helps me organize my thoughts and find the page that I want to find a lot faster. And two, I use chapters to divide my different story idea thoughts as well. That way I can see all of my story ideas on one side and then I can pick which ones I want to go to and it takes me directly there through the link. So if you're at a computer, pull up a Word document, and here it goes. Are you ready? Bam! That's it. That's all you need to do to get your first chapter. Keep doing that to get more chapters. It works the same way if you have text already written. Just highlight the text, click on header, and you've got your chapter. Now I can easily go to parts of my story just by finding the right chapter. Now if you look at the top here, you might have noticed that there are more chapter headings. These are subheadings and every sequential one is another heading under a heading under a heading. You might want to use a subheading if you want to divide your novel into three parts, beginning, middle, and end, and figure out which chapters belong in which section. But this can be confusing, so I would only do this for your own personal use. If you're trying to submit your manuscript to an agent or a publishing house, I would take out the extra headings. And the great part about these chapter headings is that if you forget how to do it, all you need to do is copy and paste and it will paste another heading for you, even if it's in a separate document. There you have it. It's super easy to get chapter headings, but it makes a world of a difference in your organization. If you found this video helpful, then please give it a thumbs up. And if you're new here and would like to see more videos on writing and publishing help, then please subscribe down below. I also post more writing tips and share my own writing journey on my Instagram page. So please follow me there if you'd like to see more. Thank you so much for watching. We'll see you next week. Bye.